Battle for Bikini Bottom. I don't actually remember where I said we were going to go in the last video, so I think we're just going to head on here into the Krusty Krab and hope that that's where I wanted to go. I think it was. I think it was pretty close, anyway. So. I feel like I be working. All right, looks like it's going to be another time trial type of deal. Don't actually know what I have to do here. I feel like a new spot. Like a I don't know what these laser eye robots do. Looks like they might blow up. They'll probably just kill all the robots again. Ouch. Time for a little sleepy sneak. Hopefully that guy, two of them don't hit me. I feel like a new sponge. Okay, good. That was annoying, but I guess it works. Oh, yep, okay, I'm gonna get hit by that too. Um, let's see, I guess now I actually have to destroy it. Nope, okay. I don't know what got me there. Alright, alright, well, I know where the robot guy, uh, spotter guy is, so... I guess I just need to come up here and... Ouch. Make it jump! Yep. Nope. Do I have to really double hit that guy? Okay. <laughs> this is actually a little bit difficult. Um, so we'll let that happen. And then... Be able to jump up here, take... Yeah, one hit. Out uh, two hits. Apparently three hits. Okay, I can't hit those guys apparently either. Well, let's go get. My goodness. I'm having a really hard time down here. Okay, let's get off of this. Alright, let's. Ouch. Got it. I can take one more hit. Okay, just kill me. I think I'm just gonna have to rush up there. I need to kill the spawner. If I can kill the spawner, then those guys on top will be fine, so all the guys on the bottom. Alright, let's just come down here. Let's just go up here and take the hit. Take two hits? Okay. Wow. Um, I guess we don't want to go back to sleep. I don't know how the heck I killed that one up there. There we go. Oh my goodness. Uh, the things that shoot projectiles in this game are so annoying. <laughs> so why did he fall asleep after shooting me that first time? It hit me. Why is he going back to sleep? Okay, okay. So I finally hit him, but then I hit the tiki. So I guess I just have to get out of it or something. I don't know. Okay, I'm out of that. And I couldn't stay on the platform. Oh my goodness. <laughs> okay, one more try. <laughs> that stupid... Oh, I'm not dead yet. But I had only one health. Oh, it's that stupid tiki that's below the guy. If I could just destroy that thing, the rest of them would be fine. It'd be so easy. Okay, so he's got to... Let that hit us, I guess. And that. Okay, we're out of it. You throw your stupid thing. Oh my goodness, that is so hard to get out of. Okay. Wow. Ugh. I need to just let them hit me once and then jump on out of there. Those take a while to actually hurt me. I can't really destroy anything because they'll just respawn them. Although I wonder if I get rid of this guy. Will that help at all? So hit me once. And let's jump on out of there. Let's just run around and let that blow you up. Yep, okay. We'll get rid of you because you already spawned him right away. Good, I think that's it for them. Whoops. 
let's get rid of these guys. Okay. Goodness, that apparently I took damage somewhere. Okay, he's dead. That <laughs> was a horrible shot, and it still hit me. He like it curved. Like what? Okay, there we go. Where's my spatula? <laughs> Nowhere, apparently. Condiment Island. I guess I could have used this thing to blow him up. I'm not sure. Could have like gotten him going and then run back. Alright, well, where's my thing reward? <laughs> I cleared the Krusty Krab! Is there any secret hidden stuff I can do back here? Get behind there, maybe? Get into the... the grill? Or is it just... some random shiny objects that I can't really do anything about? There's the crow's nest! Oh, I can actually walk on that, okay. Mr. Krabs! Really, you gotta give me a spatula for that. Phew! You had me worried there for a bit, boy. Worried for me money, of course. Oh my gosh. Here, take this as your reward. I can't listen to his voice actor anymore. It's just... Okay, we're at 50. And I can't remember where I wanted to go. I think it needed 40, right? Or did it need 50 and I said that I'd have to find it later? I can't remember now because let's see. We have 60 over there. And then 50 that way in Kelp Forest. And I think that's like, I think that's it. SpongeBob's dream, okay. With sleep comes dreams. What mischief can be found in this sub-aquatic somnambulant realm? Dream bubbles. I'm surrounded by dream bubbles. Wonder what that means. Gary, what are you doing here? Wow. Oh, so I'm dreaming. Well, then first thing I'm gonna do is dream myself up a mustache. Wow. Thanks, Gary. It does make me look more rugged, doesn't it? Wow. More tasks? Well, I could use more golden spatulas, but where should I start? Meow. You mean each dream bubble has a golden spatula in it? Meow. I'm ready! Meow. Yes, Gary, I'll be careful. Oh, his mustache went away. That's boring. Alright, well, um... We're in a dream. I didn't even know this world existed. I've seen the other worlds, because... For these older games, a lot of the times... Ooh, we got, like, the Mario Sunshine platforming going on here. But these older games, they would often, like... If you, if you let the home screen sit for a while, they would, uh... Oh, oh, dear. They would show different parts of the game. And this showed, I think, some of the later parts of the game. So I, I sort of see... I've seen that stuff before. Plus, I've seen speedruns and things of this game, too, but I've never actually watched long enough to get to the dream world if the speedrunners even come here. Who knows? This is like Mario Galaxy! What is that? My galaxy, I mean sunshine. That was me. Oh, dear. Okay, that's just, like, even worse. You're gonna make me do this, and I have to deal with this bubble robot? How? How, how do I deal with bubble robot? Okay, we're running away from bubble robot. Uh, I'll get over there later. I'm like, a little concerned that this game is getting harder. Okay. Yes. Uh, we'll buy that. I don't know what that did. I should have read that before I opened it, I guess. What did you do? Did you let me get inside the bubble? Sandy stream? Let's see if there's anything behind here for us. Tartar sauce guy, get off the edge, please. You've just met the Spongeinator. Well, I did get a... Did he shoot me from down there? I feel like a new sponge. Okay. How about you? Oh, I don't like those robots. Let's grab more of these and then head on into Sandy Stream. See what she has for us. This world is kind of cool. 
I think we get it, what, 60 golden spatulas and we'll be good. Oh, hmm, those look very narrow. As long as there's no time trials, should be fine. What? Run out of money, Your though. dream is massive. Everything in Texas is big, even dreams. Then you're just the right person to reach the spatula on top of that golden acorn. My dream, my rules. I'll get that spatula faster than a Texas jackrabbit crossing a four-lane highway. I have seen jackrabbits cross highways, and they get halfway through, stop, and then do nothing. <laughs> they are not very intelligent. Oh, alrighty then. Uh, what's the point of that? How much is that thing worth? I guess I could get that on SpongeBob, but let's just blow it up because I imagine that the amount I get from those tiki's is more. Toasted tiki Texas style. Yeah, good riddance. Someone be more. better make good use of all these. Don't worry, Sandy. We will. Okay. Well, that was a great start, and I guess that's the end of Sandy. You know, her dream wakes up because it's like those dreams where you're falling. Or skydiving. I always like the dreams. I had one dream once where- Whoa, where in the world? How'd get up here? What if I- Oh, bubble bowl that. Okay. Uh, anyway, I did have a dream once where I was like, continually skydiving. I was like, I want to be back in the airplane, and I go back in the airplane, and it starts skydiving again. That was the best dream I'd ever had, and it's never happened again. I thought I was going to start walking manure. Okay. This is actually a lot of fun right now. I mean, I don't know about jumping over manure, but... I'm surprised this game is kind of this hard. I mean, it's still not as hard as, say, Crash Bandicoot or even Rayman, but... Alright, let's go do this part. Alright. Which challenges in their own dreams? Squirrels? We're tough like that. Oh, you'll need to be real tough to make this series of swings. I could do it in my sleep. You are asleep. As I said, in my sleep. Well, there's a golden spatula out there for you if you make it far enough. I'll do it so fast, it'll make your head spin faster than a horny toad on a merry-go-round. Why can't I ever just dream normal dreams of world domination? Oh, jeez. Okay, let's hope we can make it to the small one there. There we go. Alright. So that's done. Uh, now what? Fight some... Can I touch this? Oh, it's like ice. What hit me, really? The hand or the stupid bomb? Both of those are so annoying. You. And let's just start getting rid of the tiki's because those are gonna be annoying too. Okay, that bomb did not go where did not go at all where the thing said it would. By the way. Okay. There's my spatula. There's actually an achievement, I think, to kill a whole bunch of <coughs> enemies with Sandy. This game has really easy achievements. I guess, like, if you're a trophy hunter or an achievement collector, get this game. I kind of wish Steam had, like, a, an all-encompassing score for achievements. But they don't. Uh, I think they said they don't do that because... Actually, there's something back there. Because they don't want people to make games that are achievement farms, basically. But... I guess you could kind of say, like, the number of achievements you have is sort of your count, because you can put that on your Steam profile. There it is, I knew there'd be a sock back here. I mean, how many do I have? I have enough for... Do I really have to carry Patrick's socks? I have enough for two more golden spatulas, but... Yeah. Sandy is so slow. Even on the ice. Okay, let's get out of here, and let's go back on slide. Hopefully that's like the only side area, although something down there looked like a slide area too. Or side area, slide area, whatever. You know what I mean? Which way was I going this way? I sure hope I was. Okay, let's just stick on the path because I don't know which shortcut's going to take me to the right way or the wrong way. Um, yeah, who knows. At 
least it's pretty easy to stay on these. Oh, okay, let's go up here. Uh, must be hard. Or it's hard, it must be good. Right? Oh dear. Ouch. Okay, another sock. You got a checkpoint? We'll just avoid the tiki's. Come over here. Yeah, I'm not seeing any more areas we can really go to. Maybe that one? Unless that's where I'm going. Cows are gonna throw pies at me. Is it cow pie? Okay. 